I wanted to share with you this uh, video regarding uh, my uh, 2005 uh, Nissan CRB. I like uh, all the model cars, so I decided to pressure this one with a uh, 179,000 mile. But uh, that's not the case that I'm uh, videotaping today, is to let you know about the bumper that sometimes the bumper get extremely old or worn out after all this year and it looks uh, like this so what I did I decided to uh, cover the side that I don't want to be painted and I'm going to show you right now the side that I already did and look uh, the difference in this uh, bumper it looks uh, pretty much uh, new and nice and shiny and what I did, I went to Lowe's and I bought this uh, uh, gloss protection uh, Emmy paint and it works uh, well. Uh, they had told me that uh, you can also buy one that uh, especially made for uh, plastic. But unfortunately when I got there, they didn't have no more. But I know this uh, company, uh, Rawstone Ollie works well also because we use that a lot in uh, ship so i just wanted to share with you uh that you could make your bumper look really nice just by simply uh covering the part of the car that you wanna you don't want it to be painted and for you to just simply spray it and what do you do also when you do spray it make sure you keep uh approximately like about uh 12 inch uh away from the vehicle so that's the way uh, the paint could apply nice and perfect and I'm going to demonstrate a little also right here in this section in this section right here I'm going to demonstrate just a little bit how would that look I don't want to continue uh, boring you, but uh, you get the point. That uh, it do uh, look uh, pretty nice and uh, I don't hold the can spray for too long so that's why it won't be no run on. So it could just look nice and shiny and you're gonna, by the time I remove this plastic off, it's gonna look uh, almost like, uh, like a factory or like uh, when you put a little shine on it after you uh, got the car wash so uh, enjoy it and I hope uh, I could be a little bit help to uh, anybody out there bye and you don't have to go to professional to pay all this money to get something like that done <laughs> pretty much you could do it yourself in your backyard or anywhere but make sure it's not very windy so that's the way uh, you won't over spray your car and today's a beautiful day uh, and it's not windy so i was able to do it uh, very calmly okay have a good one